Hey everyone, so I gotta tell you, I'm a little bit torn on these mirror caps that I'm about to show you, okay? Uh, this one's finished. And you can see, looks pretty good, okay? But, uh, and you'll see all this in the video. This is the cap. Now, come over here. And here's what I had before, okay? This is a vinyl wrap. It's actually a very good uh, carbon fiber vinyl wrap. I'll, I'll put a link in the, in, the, in the description below on where to get this. Uh, however, this was my first vinyl wrap. Uh, I, I'll show you all this. Anyway, my, my point right now is, like, this is a, it's got a nice 3D kind of quality to it here. And here's the cap, which, you know, it's a, it's a different color. It's, it's kind of brighter. It's kind of nice, uh, nice and new. And it's, it's, you know, one piece. Everything looks real nice. Uh, it, you don't have to deal with my, my bad vinyl wrap corner edge there. But it's, you know, obviously just way less realistic looking. Put it on there though, a little bit of a distance. Looks great, honestly. But doesn't have that real look. So yeah, I'm a little bit torn here. Do I use these caps? Do I keep them on? I'm going to show you how to put them on. They're relatively inexpensive. They're very little work. But if they're looking at my really nice vinyl wrap over there, makes me want to redo the vinyl wrap, just do a better job with it. Um, I don't, let me know. What, what do you guys like better? All right, so slight problem today. I was hoping to quickly put these things on, show you guys how cheap and easy it is to convert your average mirrors into cool carbon fiber mirrors. See this tape, double-sided tape? Should be as simple as peeling off the, the backing, sticking it on there, and then going, ooh, ah, look at how cool that mirror is. That is awesome. Except then you get to the front of the mirror and you got that. What's this? What's, what's all this? All right, now, you know, a lot of people might look at that and say, ah, so what? Who cares? Well, unfortunately, I do. I care. So now how am I going to fix that? I still have some vinyl wrap. I could maybe just put some around the edge there. That wouldn't be too hard. I have some uh, of this. Dip your car stuff. I could spray the front of that and uh, take care of that too. Uh, I don't know. I got to think about it. All right. I'm going to use the same wrap that I used for the mirror before. Use a little strip, patch up this spot here. I don't know, I'm far from an expert on this vinyl. We'll see how this goes. This did not turn out too bad at all so far. You know, I've got a cut right, right here along this, right around, where is that line? Right there. There's a line right there. So let me kind of tuck that in.
Okay, but there's no wrinkles. I'm getting a little bit better at this volume. There's a little bit of a wrinkle right there. Okay, and then if we trim that off, this won't matter. This won't matter. Cap. This will go right on here. Hey, this is this is better than white, but it's not great. Start peeling off some of this backing. Oh, could be a pain. It's a pain. Let's see how this works out if I don't drop it. I'm worried I'm going to end up sticking some part first that I don't want to. Okay, let me start with like the bottom part. Try to kind of. Ah. No, no, no. Alright, let me pull it apart first. Let's see how that does. Okay. All right, so so there it is. So, you know, looked at this before. We've seen it. Oh, by the way. I've got another video on how to black all this stuff out. This is a 2018. It normally comes chrome. Uh, this is vinyl wrapped here. Vinyl wrapped the, the camera here. All right, so here's the front, though. Or the back, whichever way you look at it. You know, this is not, this is not great, having it like this. But, you know, as soon as you get... To, uh, uh, you got to kind of look in more to see that. So I, I don't think it's it's not incredibly noticeable, but uh, this is what you get with with um, spending this amount of money. Basically, is what it amounts to. All right. So not bad. Way easier than vinyl wrapping. The other thing you can do is again uh, get some hyper dip. And you could, I thought about doing this, um, and I, in, in my other video about repairing uh, hyper dip issues, you know, if you get any little chips or peels or something, you basically just take the hyper dip, spray it into a little can, I just use the cap of the can, and get a paintbrush, a small little paintbrush, and um, paint. You could paint this white part in here. You know, you could just get some hyper dip and and, and paint that in. It's really, it, it would probably turn out okay and it would be faster. Uh, you could actually put this mirror cap on, or this, yeah, this mirror cap on and then afterwards even paint in there with, with some hyper dip. But, uh, you know, that's all, that's all up to you. This is what it is. All right. All right. So quick comparison. Here's the new one. See that? Really nice looking full one piece and here is my first vinyl wrap attempt uh, a little bit dirty here sorry and you know that it's it's the the actual carbon fiber pattern is a little bit different uh, you could argue whether one is better than the other actually this actually looks a little bit better I think this looks a little more realistic it's got a little 3d quality to it except uh, you get over here and you do have a seam um, it's a little more noticeable because, hey, it's my first vinyl wrap, and I did this in two pieces. So, uh, you know, I think some people are able to do it in one. Uh, the biggest issue with my wrap is here. So, all of these ridges here, I just was not good enough to, to take care of those, to get those out. And uh, this was definitely a lot more work than these, this cap over here. 
and uh, you know, and we had to fix the front of this thing too.